Hello and welcome to this video where we will look at how to replace values in the headers of your Power Queries. So here I have imported a table from an Azure SQL database and in the header row we can see some underscore characters in some of the headers. I would like to replace these characters with a space. Now, sure, we could replace these individually. I could simply double click on my header, replace each character with a space and go through in this manner. And in this example, I only have those four headers with underscores. All of this would be captured as one step and that is an adequate solution. But what if the headers were inconsistent? They do not necessarily have the same wording or there is not necessarily the same number of headers. Well, let's look at a solution to get this done. So the first step is on the home tab of the ribbon. I will demote the header row. I'll click on the drop down arrow next to use first row as headers and ask it to use the headers as first row. With them demoted, I can now transpose this data. So over to the transform tab of the ribbon and transpose. And that will nicely put those column headers into one column. Now they're in one column, I can perform a replace value step on that column. So keeping with my transform tab, if I click replace values, ask it to replace my underscore with a space and click OK. And we can see that is done. Now it is just a simple task of transposing it back and promoting those headers again. So transform tab transpose, they are returned to the first row of my data and then use first row as headers again. And I can access that from that transform tab. And here we have it. Our headers now have those underscore characters or whatever character you may be searching for and replace them all with a space, regardless of how many headers or what those headers may have been. A nice little trick there. I hope you found this video useful. Please subscribe to receive the latest videos at this channel. Take care and I'll see you again soon.